Testing my audio. One, two, three. Whippy. Uh, Yay. I'm testing my audio. One, two, three. Man. Gordon. Free man, Gordon. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome Hello. back to Born Losers Gaming, and welcome back to Pizza Tower, the noise update. What well, might be the last session we're going to do? Uh, I want to start on the screen because at the bottom left, uh, it shows how good we've done. Yeah. And it's 99% not the best. Uh, and I know, like, literally, that's correct. Just turned into a pizza without if, cheese on it. If there's 99%. Yeah, it's not the best. Yes. Listen. But also. Unlike you and Papino, the noise has standards. I have standards. Well, I'm glad the uh, the United States schooling system doesn't have standards because if I had to get a 99% to like pass school, like that was the standard. Like, nope, 99 is actually bad. Yeah. Um, your parents were like pretty strict with your stuff, but they weren't like helicopter parents. Uh, I had, listen, man, I had some people where if they showed up with a paper that didn't say 100 on it, they literally weren't allowed to leave their house. Okay, well, that's fair. Mine was granted, just like, if I, if I got a B, that was bad. Yeah, granted, they were from households where it was like, oh, Lord. They they had very a very strict Asian father who from birth was like you are going to be a doctor, just letting you know, <laughs> or I'm never talking to you again. <laughs> Yippee! She had she had a rough situation. What was uh, this your ex or was this someone else? Uh, I wasn't gonna disclose my okay, relationship well, in that case, to them. It, it doesn't have we don't have to say whether or not. My bad. Uh, but uh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, no. right. I don't know what I was thinking. You were thinking, God, I want to see the dead noise. Hello. It's me, the new noise. I didn't start the timer. That sounds like me. It's okay. It's. I didn't start the timer. I didn't get the P rank. Oh, I wanted to test something out this episode. What is it? So I have to pee really bad. <laughs> okay. Like I... P rank or? Yes. But okay. no. Okay. Close. Got it. I have to use the restroom. All right. And, and this is, do you think, going to help? Yes, because I think that by, like, having this pressure, you know, uh -huh. uh, is going to make it so that I play better. Okay. That's the that's the hope, right? Okay, so it's like the sooner you pee rank, the sooner you pee. Yeah, because if I take forever to do this, uh, can you, uh, can you go, Buster? Thank you. <laughs> the sooner that I get a P rank, the sooner that I can end the episode, the sooner if we don't have another 50 minute long episode where all I do is one. One. I yeah. wanna I want to I want a two P. I want to P rank you and then I Yeah. Yeah. Har, I mean har, that's har. fair. That's understandable. Exactly. So we're gonna see Wait, what? Why why did my combo end? Am I uh, nutso? Am I nutso butso? What happened? That's fine. I actually have no idea. I thought I've like super rocked it. Well, fine. I'll freaking I'll do it again. We were thinking too much about your pee. I know. We got to stop talking about it. Because it makes you focus on it, and the, then it makes you need to pee more? Yeah, the pee needs to stand for private. Does it help that I got you, like, a massive Mountain Dew uh, right before this? Oh, yep, 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 yep. Yes. Yes, it does, actually. Okay. It might not seem like it does. Okay. So, basically, what's going to happen is you're going to get a pee rank on this, right? And then you have to chug your whole Mountain Dew so you have to pee again. Okay, that's so awesome. So that next episode. Yeah, we can, we can, if it works. If it works, we got to keep filling up your bladder. Okay, can we, can we go? Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess. Okay, so I did that. I am unsure how I lost my combo. Can Maybe I, I, can what? I tell a funny story? No, that's not what we piss. Hmm. Go on. Okay, so it starts with a car accident. <laughs> yeah. All right. Awesome. So my, I'm I'm leading with that so that people are aware of where it's going. Uh, have you ever been in a situation where you did not dress appropriately for an, a surprise event that is happening? <laughs> That's that's a lot. Yeah. Uh, sure. Yes. Let's yeah. go with yes. So I was driving home today uh, from taking care of a dog, as I do. Yeah. As I always do. Yeah. 
Oh, so uh, this is literally like it was minutes literally, ago. Literally minutes ago, right before I sat down to record. Uh, and there was like a big accident of two cars like crashed into each other. Uh, they, thankfully, it looked like no one was hurt. There weren't like ambulances around. Nobody looked like overly worried. People were just playing on their phones, standing around two absolutely destroyed vehicles in an intersection. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but one of the cars had a family in it and they looked like they had been dressed for church, right? Okay. Like they were just in like very standard, nice clothes, like khakis well, and it's, like- First of all, it's Tuesday, so it couldn't have been church. It had to have been Taco Tuesday that they were right, dressed they were for. Right, they were dressed for Taco Tuesday, but they were, you know what I mean though, like acceptable church clothes. Yeah, like acceptable they were Taco wearing Tuesday clothes. Yes, I get it. You don't have to repeat yourself. <laughs> Polos and shit like that. Yes, as I wear every Taco Tuesday. I understand. I love getting uh, Poyo on my polo. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, nice one, Kirby. But <laughs> but the other was a young couple. And I'm going to describe the guy's outfit to you. Okay. He was wearing fire truck red tiger print sweatpants. Hell yeah. A mesh neon green shirt. Like fishnet. Nice. And he had a hot pink scarf oh, over my, his head. I just lost. It's not fair. It jump scared me. What was the last one? And he had a hot pink scarf on his head. Hell yeah. On he, his head. On his head. Just okay. like draped over his head. It oh, wasn't okay. wrapped. It was draped. And it was a scarf, not like a bandana or something? It was a scarf. It okay. was for sure a scarf. I assume that it was around his neck previously, but it's 100 degrees outside, yeah, so he's trying to protect himself. It's heat wave day, baby. Uh... But I was just like, I love your outfit. You do not look like you should have just gotten into a car crash. <laughs> you have better things to be doing right now. I'm assuming what you yelled out the window. I did. I was like, you're dressed too nicely <laughs> to have crashed into that minivan. Uh, That's really funny. Also, the girl that was in the car with him was in the tightest black dress I've ever seen with the most amounts of holes in it I've ever seen. Nice. Uh, she was very hot. Nice. Okay. And probably also very temperature really hot. Well, also. Okay, I guess because it was very hot tight. outside. That of holes. That's 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 like ventilation. That's you know? more space for the sun to touch you, my man. What? There's a reason why when you're in the desert, you cover all your skin. It, babe, it's not that hot out. It's fucking hot. No, it is. It is hot, but it's not like we shouldn't compare it to the desert. I will. I'm I don't comparing know. it. Our, our, all the grass is starting to die. All the grass is starting to die. I was outside for five seconds, uh, letting some dogs pee, and oh my god, I started sweating immediately. It is so hot. And all of the grass being dead means the ground is like white. So it's fucking reflecting off of the dead grass into my face. <laughs> You're saying the glass is like literally reflective? Yeah. It's like having a, a toaster in your lap on the beach, you know? Why, Shining the why, light back on you. I think many people do know what that's like. So I'm, I think it's exactly a good, like it. It was a good example. Uh, Or, you know, one of those. Mouse, it's like a casita that covered in tinfoil, whatever those are called. A casino covered in tinfoil? Casita. Did you use casitas in school? No, I, I have no idea. You gotta be... Mmm. Mmm. Maybe I go do war first. Maybe I do war... I feel like I could do war better. I've never done that. You know what? Yeah. I feel like I could do war better. So, I feel like I could do war better. Yeah. You can do war better. Most people think that after war. Like, <laughs> we could have done, done that better. could have done that better. Yeah. Um, it's hindsight, I, man. I think I think people should stop thinking that. And, ah, oh! I forgot how scary that, that was. That was hot. Okay. Uh, so a ca casita uh, means little house in Spanish. Okay. Uh, and it was just what we called like cardboard dividers that you use during tests. Yeah. Uh, it was like three. It was like a presentation thing you would use during a science fair, except much shorter, and you put it up on your desk. Oh, I can just. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 I got it. I got it. Yeah. Let's, wait. Wait. Why are we talking about this? Oh, because uh, if you covered that in tinfoil, you could use it to tan. Oh, right. I forgot we're not talking about tinfoil casinos, which no. still don't really make that much sense to me. Tinfoil casinos I'm not sure why you brought and up tinfoil casita are two different things, but it would both be a tinfoil building if you're translating it literally. Yeah. So, are you shooting pistachios? I don't know. I don't think I ever really thought about what? it. Oh, just getting the fucking- Oh, it's macaroni! 
Oh, it's just, I'm just like Honest Abe or whatever. Who, Why is it? Whoever put the macaroni in his hat. Uh, that was... Stuck a feather in his cap. And called it macaroni George. Yankee Doodle. Oh, it was Yankee Doodle, yeah, not it was Honest Yankee Abe. Doodle. No. Oh, man. That was, you thought that song was about Abraham Lincoln this whole time? No. Or I, just now? I just forgot. Abe Lincoln had a hat. Abe Lincoln was real dumb. Called a feather macaroni. Oh, no. I don't think I, I feel like <laughs> Abe Lincoln was probably a macaroni guy. I feel like everyone's a macaroni guy except for the people who aren't. He doesn't that like really... he actually doesn't like chain oh, restaurants though, I'm pretty sure. Why? He doesn't like booths. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. Like great job, dude. Thanks. Wow. Alright, well now I don't I'm not oh. as worried about uh getting like a P rank because I don't I think like we I've like we gotta do one of two things. We gotta be funny. Yeah. Or I gotta get a P rank. Okay. Got and it. You were funny. Excellent. So now we can we you can go pee. Oh shit I can Yay Except I'm not going to. Yeah. I haven't earned it. You haven't earned it. I like you've earned it, right? Yeah, I can go pee. Yeah. I don't, ha I don't have to right now. Should I chug my drink? I have a... a no, I need you here. Drink at the day. Okay. It's cherry Coke. That's awesome. I just missed a secret. I'll do that on my way back, I guess. I I guess. You got it. I think I got to mm. shoot. Oh, I don't. That's awesome. You got it. Thank you. Pizza. 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 Pizza shit. Oh, pizza macaroni. Yeah. Oh, pizza shit. That's also funny. Do you oh, think geez. that uh, it's easier to do this level as the noise? Why? Because you can just cheese it. All right. <laughs> <laughs> the macaroni. Been holding on to that one like the entire series. Yeah. Just waiting to let it rip. Why yeah. is there water? On the bright side, you can't get arrested for having a firearm. <sighs> Why? Because that one's an impasta. <laughs> Like the gun is in, is, yeah, because yeah, uh, 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 kind of it's shooting pasta. Yeah. yeah. No, you're right. You're right. I'm wrong for having thought that you were going to say anything bad. What you said was very clever. <laughs> and I'm not lying. Uh. Oh, that's awesome. That's really cool. I've lost. No, babe. I'm sorry. Why is there a refrigerator mounted on the wall? Is this another joke, or is this a Casey no, question? there's just a refrigerator mounted on All the right, wall. All right, Casey question. Um, everywhere needs a refrigerator, hun. Okay. I'm know. pretty sure that's obvious. Yeah. Okay, cool. Missed the bell. Didn't want it anyway. Woo! Oh, that's awesome. I missed. Fired. And I missed. Oh, God. Ugh. God. You know, if you I go into the noises kitchen... You can tell he's obsessed with revenge. Oh my god, this this is gonna be another joke. What is why? Why? Because if you open his cupboard, it's just desserts. <laughs> god! I mean, I don't know why I'm mad. I can't even concentrate to talk right now. So it's like I, I don't want you to go pee because I need somebody here yeah. to say something other than uh, uh, I could try saying that too. <laughs> well, if we both start doing that, we'd have to upload this to a different like website. Uh, yeah, they might demonetize yeah. by default, and then we'd be like, "Can you uh, can you undemonetize?" And they'd be like, "Actually, afterwards, we watch the content and." Uh, no, we cannot. We decided you guys are just not worthy of money. Yeah, at all anymore. Actually, yeah. perma. Absolute perma, just you're you're done. You're We've gone. We've actually sent somebody to your house to take the money that you've <laughs> already been given yeah. from you. It's like, do I get like the money that we paid on taxes back? And they're like, no, no, <laughs> no, son, daughter. Why did you do that? I don't know. Oh man, what? You can't talk to your children that way. And yet, I mean, unless you... they're doing some real stupid shit. Yeah, like that's. I mean, that's kind of what I'm doing. Go. Run! Are you your own son? I'm as, I'm disappointed in me like one might be. Wow. That's crazy. Your parents are never disappointed in you. That's not true. They love you and support your dreams no matter what. Well, maybe that's my mom does. 
Not to say my dad doesn't support my dreams. He does. He just probably also wishes that I finished college. Became a lawyer or something? No, I, I think it's just finished college. Yeah. Because now his brother is the one that had the kid that finished college first in the family. Ah. Uh, so he won, and we didn't. I my mean, bad. Yeah. That just means I have to go to college and finish college. Go. Okay, that's cool. That's awesome. Yes, I. and you know what? Do it. And you know what? I missed... I mean... Get, no, okay. No, that's awesome. Uh... Can I fire up, by the way? Have I tried that? I don't know. Can I... Okay, you can. That's awesome. Okay. Saucy. No, it's not, it's not saucy. It's awesome. It's so oh, awesome. it's so awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God you're here. What are we doing? We're playing <laughs> Pizza Tower for the 10th time. And again, I mean, like, luckily I've played more recently than last. Yeah. But we are doing the hardest levels in the game when I really don't have the experience I once had, which means I'm bad now, and also the noise is just harder for me. Yeah, the can Pino you- The clicks. It doesn't click. Noise don't. Can you uh, do the the butt stamp when you have the gun no. or not? No, well, you have to start to fire down first, is the problem. Oh. Okay, no, it's awesome. Go, get out of here. Okay. And then I gotta do this, and then do that. Yep, there we go. And then oh, I fire that. so you can't do the move that has the stamp. Uh oh, the stamp move. Oh, yeah. that's awesome. That's super cool. Okay, we're good. I didn't know if you just lost his normal moves when you have the gun. Well, the stamp is a little different. The stamp is like that move. Yeah. You can still do that, but that takes more time because you get sent upwards. You can't do the normal butt stomp. Well, yeah, but you can, like, infinite jump with that, right? So in that previous situation where you couldn't get up high enough, could you have not used oh, the stamp? yes, you're right. It, then that's why the, I just, I don't think of that, because it, 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 it wasn't a button combination that Pepino had. It's, like, yeah. up in A, and Pepino didn't have that, so it just doesn't oh, work in my mind. Yeah, uh, you gotta take advantage of the noises moveset well, to not I'm, treat him like a reskin of Pepino. But that's what I'm saying when I'm saying that, like, okay. The I, noise doesn't click? I, yeah, because it's just not in my brain in the same way. That's fair. Because, uh, like, I, I, I need to do that? Yes. If I want to play the game better, I need to play the game better. You're right. Yeah. I almost wonder uh, if you would be better at the noise if you weren't playing the same levels. Because in the levels, you're like, I'm used to this. This is how I would do it as Papino. But if you were playing brand new levels, then you'd be like, okay, how does the noise do this? That's a good question. Maybe uh, Pizza Tower 2 will be able to figure that out. Yeah. I don't know, because it, no matter what, it's these these button combinations that I'm really just not... Is there a Pizza Tower 2? Uh, no. I mean, what? What? I, I had... I got... Okay, I'm gonna be really normal. Yeah. About this, and not like Ian normal, like real, like actual normal. Yeah, a, a, a normal that's not seen much on BLG. That's good. I'm gonna be better than the rest of them, tougher than leather. You remember that episode of SpongeBob where no. it, he was like all ironed out and normal, and he kept going, "Hey, how are you?" Hey, how are you? Hey, <laughs> dude. All right, let's get to me. That's going to be you? Yeah. That's great. I always thought that was... Uh, I, th I think your SpongeBob impression, and not to come for your throat over the important things, your SpongeBob impression could use some work. Uh, I mean, it was me doing the impression of SpongeBob doing the impression of like a middle-aged office worker. So, wow, no, you... Uh, yeah, that's fine. You just want him to have his independence, you know? You saw George over there and you were like, he doesn't want to follow me. He's got his own things going on. Lopez? Yeah. You know, okay. from Shark Boy and Lava Girl. Yeah, his only work. The only thing he's known for. Okay. No, I think you're thinking of Spike is three. No. He was in Shark Boy and Lava Girl. He was Mr. Electric. Was he? Yeah. He might have also been in Spy Kids. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, George Lopez has been in everything. You could tell me almost anything and I would believe it. I thought kind you of, just said that he had only ever been in Shark Boy and Lava Girl. Uh, yeah, but I would be able to believe that he'd been in anything. Because he was so good in Shark Boy and Lava Girl. 
I just feel like he shows up in unexpected places. I also feel like that about Jack Black, but I'd probably be happier to see Jack Black. Because he seems like he's got, like, just a more happy spirit. You know what I mean? I swear you used to not like Jack Black. Uh, I do not like a lot of things Jack Black is in. Well, used to be in. Yeah. Just Tenacious D. I didn't like Tenacious D. I... If you say you didn't like School of Rock, you're wrong. No, I didn't like Nacho Libre. Oh, well... (laughs) I mean, that's weird. It's funny, because I feel like our sense of humor comes across like we would like sh- like movies like Nacho Libre and Napoleon Dynamite. Yeah. But we're really, we're not, and I don't know how to express that without f- seeming like I'm, like, I, I just have to line up. That's weird. I got a severe burn on my thumb when I watched Napoleon Dynamite. I got to the part of the movie where they killed a cow with my dad, and we were both like, hey, are you liking this? And we were both simultaneously like, no. And then we stopped watching. That's actually really <laughs> impressive for your dad to not like something. Because I feel like I he'll know. just watch anything. I Like, looking back at it, it takes... I, I don't think he's ever done that. I ever. guess I guess we found out... Son! Why did you do that? I don't know, Dad! We found out what it takes. Killing a cow. Well, and also just everything else that had yeah. led up to that part of the movie. Yeah. I, uh... I remember watching, and like like with everything, no hate to people who do like these movies. Of course. It's just different tastes, different strokes for different yokes, you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, but I got, we watched all of Napoleon Dynamite, and even if I hadn't badly burned my finger, I would have just been like, yeah, that was the most mid-movie I've ever seen. Like, I didn't laugh out loud one time. Which isn't saying much for me because it takes a lot to make me laugh out loud when I'm not recording and needing to show my emotions. <laughs> um, All right. But yeah, it's, I didn't even have like the thought in my mind of, oh, that was funny. I don't think more than maybe once. Yeah, I mean, because it's really hard for anything, even things you don't like, to be like, oh man, that was not funny at all. Yeah. You know, it's like, I'm sure I laughed in my watching of like 30 minutes of the movie yeah but also <laughs> yeah ah. i feel you no it's okay god i just i don't it was in, it was so popular when we were in high school i think it still is oh, well I mean, i'm obviously sure not it this- is but when it came when it first came out it was massive like i cannot express how many vote for pedro shirts i saw in a day yeah no you're when right I was at school it was absurd god i'm so bad at this part <sighs> Ugh. It was like, vote for Pedro and McLovin shirts. Those were the two that it's like, I just... Was, wasn't McLovin super bad? Yeah. Completely different thing. Yeah. But it was another one of those I also didn't find that funny. Yeah. And it was I, also hugely popular. Like, I've definitely seen scenes from Super Bad that I, I've enjoyed, but yeah. I don't know if it'd be a movie for me. Probably not. I don't know, though. Uh, I but also... I, I liked um, Hot Rod... Hot Rod. Which one was that? I don't. It was another of that of that type. I I, was, I, oh, I don't remember if it was called Hot Rod or not. Hmm. It was one about somebody who liked race. Uh, hmm. I Racing. Don't remember. It was a Talladega Nights. I, I did like Talladega Nights. Okay. Uh, but it's also been a long time since I've seen Talladega Nights. So. I like the one about the one about the ice skaters was terrible, and it made me laugh sometimes. The, I, the ice skaters? Yeah, I forget. I think Will Ferrell was one of them. I'd like to see Will Ferrell. As or an was ice it skater. Owen Wilson? They fill the same space wow. in my mind, or Which, at least they used to. Owen Wilson has a slightly different space now. Uh, so does Will Ferrell. Now he's always the evil dad. That's true. He's a bad daddy. Except for when he's a good dad. Yeah, except for when he's a good dad. But he's a misunderstood dad. He is a dad nonetheless. Which is me right now. Well, you're, no, I'm a misunderstood. You're a disappointed dad. Yeah. Which and makes you're me also s- a disappointing son. Yeah. We're, I'm just. I'm. I am disappointing. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Oh, that's awesome. Me. As long as you stay an impressive and passionate lover, then I Thank don't you. mind. So long as your girth remains unchanged, <laughs> you may the be- The girth of your heart. Yeah. And also your t- 
10 inch minimum. Can we not talk about this on Pizza Tower? Uh, I think Pizza Tower is the best place to talk Kirby's about it. Kirby's the best it. place to talk about it. We're not playing Kirby right now. I know. And if there is one thing that I've learned through all of this, it's that Pizza Tower is basically a Kirby game. You see in the enemies in this game? They're Kirby. Okay. If you uh, were to kill... I don't think Kirby tongues... If you were to kill a frog person in Kirby, no one would bat an eye. They'd just be like, yeah, Kirby has a fucking Gene Simmons tongue now. That's Kirby's ability. Okay. Kirby's ability is impressing your mom. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, yo. Amen. Uh, you, have, uh, you have 39 seconds left. Okay, I missed. You did. Uh, I'll get it when I finish the level. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, I got it. I'm sure. You know what? <laughs> I'll get it later. No gun. In you go. Okay. This might actually be easier now. Yeah. Because I don't have a gun. And I don't want a gun. Though a gun that shoots peanuts and other macaroni bits. Peanuts are not a macaroni bit. All right. We had a friend, uh, did, was it Pizza Tower we mentioned this on that told us to put a spoonful of peanut butter into Kraft Macaroni, and it was pretty good. Did we do that? We did. Uh, uh, and it, it gave it like a, you know how a lot of Asian restaurants have like a peanutty sauce? Oh, yeah. It, it kind of had that sort, like an off-brand version of that sort of vibe. Yeah. Um... And also ramen, like a little spoonful of uh, peanut butter. And ramen? Yeah. Did we do that too? I don't remember if we did that one. Okay. But I do remember that the peanut butter and the macaroni was okay. It was like I <laughs> it's ate- It's no sugar, let me tell you that. I ate it and I was like, yeah, this is good. Uh, but I haven't done it since then and I think that says something. You know what I mean? Oh, no. I feel like- when you try something and you're like, oh, that's pretty good, okay. and then you eat all of it, it yeah. would stand to reason that it was successful. But if you never go back to it again, was it, though? That's kind of fair. Yeah. Why are there buckets everywhere, dude? Uh. Do you think the creator of Pizza Tower secretly loves Homestuck and it's all just been a 2012 Homestuck joke? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, for sure. No, yeah. I need to hit someone. Okay. Me when I've been in a Walmart for too long. Me when I worked at a retail job for too long. Uh, yeah, true. Every <laughs> I, I'm 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 back on Casey's side. I feel like every retail employee needs uh deserves a minimum of like uh like one. Uh, oh my I, god! Even, I think one crossbow. Fire. I don't know, Cra I even just like one uninterrupted slap per week to a customer. Yeah, that's what I said, but I but with a crossbow. Yeah. Oh my god. I just think it's fair. And I think it would teach people to not disrespect retail workers because they don't fucking know if you've used uh, your slap. Okay. And even if you have, they don't know if your coworkers have. Yes! Oh, good job, baby! Oh my god. Oh, so do you think uh, needing to use the restroom helped? No. Next time I'm Born Losers Gaming. Yeah? Yeah. I'm going to go use the restroom, and then we're going to go back to- um. Just trying without the, other, the pain. Yeah the, yeah, the other level. Yeah, that's understandable. All right. Uh, be, uh, next time, uh, don't do war, kids.